you know, so in reality, you got. Um, Um, after that, let's see. Hammer 12B. When you do that, go. Tap 13. Then check this out. This is just crazy, man. Go, go. As you're tapping the 13, you're going to hold it, scoot your third finger back a whole step to 10. As it's bent, then release it. So. It's craziness, man. I mean, this is stuff Eddie just does, man. It just comes out. Once you get there, pull off to eight. Hammer ten. So, let's see. Three sixteen. Um, almost a chromatic run. Twelve. 14. When you get to 14, just play one fret at a time until you get to 22. Play it twice, bend it a whole step. Okay, it's real staccato, so choppy. Don't go. Just, you gotta silence each one. Okay, I think that's it. No, there's a little bit more. Open G, open E, 3B. Three, pull one, and then pick one on the B. Three twenty-six timestamp. Five D, slide to seven, and go five G three B. So it's you may want to use your pinky on that because he's gonna do this. It's craziness. Um, so once you get to the 3B, you'll start your alternate picking, and you're just going to want to try to synchronize the, the timing of it, you know, get used to the, the consistency of the 16th notes. And then you can just kind of drop into 5th fret with the 3rd finger and just start moving it up. Until you get to the octave, which is 15, once you get there, start bending it. Bend it a whole step, then take it another step. That's four frets. So, there's your whole step. That's your uh, two steps. Whole step is two frets. Um, two steps is four frets. So you'll see a circle two there and vibratos. All right, 17th fret on the B. You're gonna bend that two and a half steps, I kid you not, which is five frets to this note. Four times. And then you're back to some repeats. Section two, which was I think section two was the Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, the kind of the intro solo melody. He goes back to that. That's the that whole Um, so you'll go through that, and then section four will come back in. That's the... put six times there. Now he's overdubbed a couple other guitars, so I figured let's get back to some fat rhythm there. Uh, 414, the end of the song. 12D, 11G, 10B. So what's happening there? Twice. And then 12th fret, D, G, and B three times. Make sure you rest those. So. 
Those ones ring, the twelves don't. So three times. And then twelfth fret, D, G, and B slide to fourteen, strum it, whammy bar vibrato. So you'll go. Open A, second fret, D, G, and B, strum. But you know, this song's gonna be in my head for for many days, Eddie. Anyways, you can torture me anytime you want with some more. Van Halen CBTs, Eddie. I'd be glad. I'll give you cuts in front of everybody. This was fun. So uh, I know you're going to have fun with it. Break it down. Uh, subgroup it. Take your time. Use the timestamps that I provided for you in your tabs. Match them up to the video. Use the isolated track so you can hear just the guitar. Then go to the whole band version so you can jam along with it, alright? Really appreciate it, Eddie. Thanks, man.